What's going on YouTube? This is Marcos back again with another video. In this video, I'm gonna show you how I clean my PC. Cleaning your PC is very important because it can help it from not overheating. When dust builds up, it will slow down the performance of your computer. Okay, the first thing you wanna do is disconnect the PC. Next, you wanna take it to a ventilated area because it will be a lot of dust. Now, you will need a Phillips head screwdriver to take off the case of your PC. My case has side panels, so it's gonna be very easy for me because I only have to take off one side. Now, before I clean it, I'm gonna just gonna point out a lot of the areas of the PC where it's dirty. The majority of all the dust that you will see is gonna be around the fans and the vents. checking my air compressor to make sure there's no water coming out of it because they build up condensation on the inside. Now take your air source and just start blowing everything out. You may want to wear a mask for this because it will be a lot of dust flying everywhere. Make sure that you spray everything. Be sure to take your time on cleaning the fans. It's not working, you may want to take a rag or a paper towel to wipe it down. You don't have to be this extreme when cleaning your computer. Can Am will give you the same results. I tried to clean any and all air vents from the inside, but it doesn't always work. So let's clean the vents from the outside then go back to the inside and clean it one more time. Now that I just cleaned the vents, let's clean the fans one more time. If you have too much dust build up on your fans, they will start working. Be sure to clean the fans on the video card and the heat sink. few more final touches and then we can put the case back on. Before you put your cover back on, make sure that all connections are still connected. Right here I'm just taking my screws and make sure that the case is secure. Now let's go put everything back. See, there's no dust on the vents, no dust on the fans. Now we're ready to power up the PC. At this stage, if your computer does not come on, you may need to go back in and check your connections. YouTube, that's it for this video. Please like it, subscribe to the channel, and I will see you in the next video. This is Marcos. Peace out.